And uh, what's your name? Lelia Goldberg. You, what you've done so people... Well, um, for one thing, my very first film was a film called Shadows, which was directed by John Cassavetti. And it was uh, uh, groundbreaking because A, it was improvised, and uh, also it was uh, a story about a black family, and I played a black person, and everybody believed it. I didn't have any makeup on, but because we created the relationship so powerfully, it became, it, to them, the truth. Anyway, so that was my first film, but I've done lots of other films. Alice doesn't live here anymore, and Blood Brothers, blah, 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 blah. blah. So what brought you out here today? Why are you here? Okay, baby, now I'm gonna go. I came out here today because my father was one of the architects of the Ladies' Gone Orchestra. My family has been in unions for years. I, I understand what unions mean and how important they are. And so I felt that uh, for a long time, uh, we uh, drifted. I, I retired because I was in that never, never land in terms of I was too young and too old uh, to play old ladies. Now that I'm 71, I'm back and watch out. And that's that's why I'm here today is to support not only the Writers Guild, but all unions. I mean, we're living in a time now where people think that they can earn money off of your labor without paying you. And that is slavery. This is about labor reversing the labor uh, uh, in, in opposition to people who are totally uh, egotistical and greedy. And the labor unions, the laborers, I understand, but I'll tell you, they're going to get you one of these days too if you don't pay attention. Because that's what it's about. It's about turning us all into serfs. I think, I think the, the fact of the matter is, is that if, if you are looking at this purely egotistically, and I, I, I understand that because we all have families or I have myself to feed, et cetera, et cetera. Um, you know, they haven't taken away my social security yet. But the thing about it is, is you have to pay attention to what that future is going to be for you. Because if they can do it across the board, they will. I mean, greed knows no bounds and knows no uh, um, area that this is okay over here, but not over here. And I think you must be very mindful of where we are all at right now.